Okay, everybody, Dr. Rick here. So appreciate your um, joining us. Today we're actually going to put a um, quick connect charger port for our um, trickle chargers on here. S simple project. It's really more about the ideal. We bought a two pack on Amazon. We're going to take it out. Um, we got one for both machines that we got going right now. But I'm, we're getting tired of hooking the battery charger up all the time. And so we just figured we'd just plug it in here and we can run it from there. So really the main thing we need is drill to 7 8 bit, um, some screws or bolts, whatever you want to put here. 7 8 because we have a little recess right here. I don't know if you can see that or not. And we, that's the 3 quarter, it's just a hair bigger than the 3 quarter. And then we got the marker so we can actually mark where we want it. So anyhow, um, the foil is still taken apart a little bit from the last project. If you come up here, you'll see that we still have the front taken apart and this here from when we made it street legal. If you don't know how to take it apart, look at it, but most of you guys are pretty smart when it comes to this thing. Basically, what we want to do is figure out where we want this to be make sure we got some clearance in here because we want to just run the wire straight through once we drill it and there's a junction box here that we, we all have, we always have the connection so right about in here looks like it's pretty good so I just gotta mark it a little bit grab the tape measure So we have a 1 and 7 8 diameter. So. looks pretty close we just do it right here we'll have a pretty good spot for where we want it just like that and so what we're going to do now is we're going to pause for a few seconds here we're just going to need some pigtails about six inches we'll get our pigtails put on and then we'll um, come back and then just get this fastened up and show you how what else left on the project okay so we got our wires um, extended we put um, the soldered we have the solder um, butt connectors where you just heat and melt the solder. Then we put the heat shrink over top of it. And then we got this slide in over on this end, ran it right through the hole. I'm going to cut these the length and then we're going to take and put them on the um, terminals here. So this terminal goes straight to the battery, so does this one. So get them cut, pop on here. Make 
sure it's the right size, I'll slide over. Perfect. Okay, so before we route that, we'll hit it with the heat shrink gun. Okay, so that's all set. So we'll take a few minute break here, get these um, heat shrunk, get this one about fastened in, get these pulled off, and then we'll come back just about as we're wrapping it up. Okay, the only thing left is this thing here. So, I'm um, recording this. That, you are? Okay, so we just finished up tightening these up here. The wires ran down, ran the positive up underneath and over through here. Um, I did throw a rag over the cap so I didn't short out the wrench any time at all. Um, so this is all done on this end, which is nice because now we can put this cap back in, this sh dust shield, as we got everything done up in here. The only thing left is, you know, we just have to mark how we want this orientation here. Pre-drill a couple holes, and then we're all set for this project to be wrapped up. So we'll move the camera back here in case anybody wants to see it. I um, believe that's it, except for, like I said, now this piece can go in for that portion of the project. So you see how this is all set in place now. Up here, we just put these four screws up here, and now that part's done. Um, so let me get a little drill, and we'll use the screws that came with it. And um, hold back in one second. So we just got a three thirty seven.
Okay, so there we have it. So, um, the main thing between um, what we um, didn't talk about at the beginning, it took us about 20 minutes to do this job. Um, we talked about the 7 8 paddle bit with the drill. We did not talk about the um, Phillips or the 332 bit. And that's about it. So, um, it's a simple job. Anybody can do it. And um, it's going to be nice not to have to swap out to pull the battery out in between seasons or to do a quick charge. Just pop it in and go. Okay, so thank you for um, watching and let us know if there's anything you have questions about. Have a good day.